Hi, my name is Winston Gao. I'm an inventor, researcher in the field of agriculture, water, and soil-based microorganisms. And today we're going to talk about reverse osmosis water. This is probably one of the most common water. Like 90% of your bottled water is going to be reverse osmosis water. Most of the Americans that have a home-based filtration system is going to be a reverse osmosis water. So it is the number one most commonly utilized water filtration system. Now, you'll find the more conventional people believing that this is a very good water, and you'll find some alternative people who say, no, 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 distilled water is better, reverse osmosis is not, and you get all the mixture of things. So sticking to the subject of reverse osmosis water, what's so bad about it? This is what you can observe. Number one, a reverse osmosis water has a 5.5 to 6.4 pH. That's acid water. Okay. Number two, it has no minerals in it. So it is a very, very powerful water that can leach minerals out of the water. Leach anything out of anything that it makes contact with. So if it happens to be a plastic bottle, it'll leach out the plastic bottle. If it touches your mouth, it can leach out the minerals out of your mouth. And when it goes into your system, it can leach out the bones and the calcium and etc. out of your body. So if you get osteoporosis after 25, 50 years of drinking reverse osmosis water, well, you shouldn't be surprised that you have an issue because that's the nature of this water. It is designed to leach things out. That's just problems on the surface. There's more to it. How many people here have soaked seeds in order to sprout them? And then you had a problem. You had fungus growing throughout the beds of your seeds. And then you blamed the seed company for giving you a bad set of seeds. I like to tell you, the seed company is innocent. It's the kind of water that you used. You see, reverse osmosis water has a tendency to grow fungus. So if you sprout your seeds, chances are seven out of 10 times, you're gonna end up with fungus growing among your beds. Now, question, if you drink reverse osmosis water, do you think you might be growing fungus in your gut? What do you think? We also have phenomenal probiotic products made with our ideal earth water. For more information, please call us at 727-447-2344 or email us at info at gobeyondorganic.com. Or you may go directly to our website, www.idealearthwater.com or www.turbocharged.com turmeric.com. You can also order any of our products by calling us, emailing us, or directly on our website via our shopping cart. Thank you very much for listening.